with uh, Boundary Devices here at the Freescale Technology Forum. You have 12-inch Android? 12.1-inch Android tablet uh, that Surface Inc. Uh, designed uh, the enclosure. Uh, we designed the electronics that are inside. Unfortunately, I broke the, I saw the it USB. Before. But uh, you, you broke the charger, so last year they showed just the mock-up. Now it's actually now working. Now it's actually working. There's We have a YouTube video of this. Right. Uh, I broke it the first day of the show. There's a link down here for that video? Yes. Uh, and we, we basically have designed uh, two different products here that are single board computers uh, based on the IMX51 and IMX53 uh, board processors. This one is the IMX53. It's an expansion of the quick start board. So we've exposed uh, many interfaces, more interfaces, such as camera, LVDS, touch screen. Um, we've added SATA and HDMI all on board uh, for quick and easy development. We have this available right now, and it's running inside this box. It's running um, power over Ethernet in this case. So all the power is coming from the Cat5 cable. And we have it hooked up to this 24-inch Acer uh, capacitive multi-touch monitor. So uh, it's it's got dual ge dual ge uh, gestures. Let me uh, show off the, the touch screen. So you can see it's got multi-touch capabilities. Very very uh, good uh, feedback. The 53 processor has got uh, excellent video playback. So full 1080p. And these are all 1080p videos that are running on the on the HDMI monitor. Nice. Everything's fast and smooth. Exactly. So you paused here. So now we play. And we can actually set up with dual display. So you can run one display with HDMI and the second display uh, with, um, with a 7-inch or a 10-inch to, to have two different displays. Nice. Uh, what version of Android do you run right this now? This is Android 2.3. Nice. That's kind of recent. So, um, what does it take to get a honeycomb? So we're waiting for Freescale to, to release Honeycomb to, to the general public. Uh, right now they do have it in their hands, but it has not been released to, to the board developers. So All that's right. coming soon. What is this bone factor? So this is uh, basically the 51 uh, that was designed uh, to fit directly behind a 6.2 inch display. All of the connectors are coming off so we can make a nice module for this. Uh, it has a four wire resistive touchscreen and this is used primarily in casinos for the player tracking modules. Nice. And this is running Windows Embedded 6.0, CE6. So, uh, boundary devices, how many boards do you make? Different designs? How many stuff? different designs? We have over, we have between 10 and 20 different designs. Um, on Freescale based designs, we have uh, 5 to 10 different versions, including a version that's intended for tablets only. Uh, we're currently working on a, a ruggedized tablet as well. It should be one of the first Android ruggedized tablets with a so where are you based? We're based in uh, Chandler, Arizona, um, and we've been in business since 2003. 2003, and you design the motherboard there? We design all the motherboards and they're manufactured there. Uh, we do many custom designs, taking the existing uh, you know, development versions and customizing them for different customers. And then we, we help them uh, with their OS level support, so we provide either Android, CE, or Linux, and we provide all of the dri device drivers uh, uh, for, the, for the kernels. Can you estimate if you have a screen, how much it costs to add your functionality to the screen, or a box what? like this, how much you could sell it for? A box like this in quantity one is like $250. Uh, in quantity once, and the pricing drops very quickly after that. Order, thousands and yeah, stuff. It gets, it gets price How about the motherboard? Quickly. One like this. Yeah, we sell that. Uh, basically, we sell them together for that price. What's the bill of material? Like? Cost-wise, it's like a uh, two hundred fifty for one, and then uh, very cheap if you buy. Yeah, un it. under yeah. definitely under two hundred dollars. Yeah. All right. So uh, the website boundary devices. Yes.